Okay, what I think I'm going to work on now is my 2008 Chevy uh, 2500. It's got the Duramax in it. Let me show you what I got here. So, we bought this fifth wheel. This truck actually came with this hitch in it. And it's, this is a short bed truck, so they make these roller hitches to help you back up. It can slide back this much, so it changes your pivot point up there to back behind your wheels, and it's supposed to be so you can make it, so it can back up better. So the first time I go to use it, I yank the handle over there. It's the one with the yellow, kind of yellow-orange handle over there. And my trailer's hooked to it, and uh, I give it some gas, and it slides back and jammed it right into my tailgate, the trailer. So it kind of jacked up the tailgate, bent the pins. So what I think I'm going to do is I bought a new tailgate cap. So I think I'm going to uh, look and see what it's going to take to fix my tailgate. So let me get you on a tripod and we'll start taking this thing apart. All right, you should be able to kind of see what I'm doing there. So let me grab my drill. When I bought this truck, it uh, this section of the tailgate right here this thing was missing. And I thought, well, that's kind of weird. But the guy that owned it before me must have made the same problem when he went to open it. Okay, well that came off pretty good. Okay, so if we look at it, there's a little bit of a bow in the tailgate there. And I think I might just try to hook a strap to the fifth wheel hitch and come up over the top here and see if I can't just pull that back into into line so let me set you down over here again and uh, grab a strap So we're still dealing with the, I guess you don't need to look at the ground so much. Let's lift you up. Maybe you can see me. Still dealing with the COVID. I don't know about you guys, but I've about had enough of it. <laughs> so...
just uh, in the process of posting a video of going out on the desert for a weekend and getting a little uh, motorcycle ride in. Had a good time. Got a mouse in the trailer. That's always fun. Let's have a look. Well, it's still a little crooked. Let me move uh, move down here a little bit and pull on it from down here. You can see that it puts some dents in there. Might have to see if I can pop some of that out. Make sure you're getting a good angle.
didn't realize that my camera angle is kind of close, you guys. You don't get to see. I'm going to grab my So most of this is going to be covered up, but She's still pretty bent. Let's uh, let's see how the new cap fits. 
might be a little more forgiving. This is a little different, a little different style. Supposed to be the spoiler, the wider. Once I get that tape off, get it down where it goes, let's see if we can get that off. It never did stick very good. Okay, I'll bring you back once I get that cleaned up. Okay, so I did the scary thing and I used a razor blade. This is scary. To knock off all the big pieces of this stuff double-sided tape. And now, I've had this bottle of stuff for years. It's called Goo Gone. Let's see what it does. Well, the goo's not gone. But I think the tailgate the double-sided gets covered. So I don't know if it's that big of a a deal.
Okay, so I've got to get these things put in now. And it does look like I've got to get this uh, stuff off. That is scary. up towards the top, I guess. Scary. So we've got these holes that match this, but I think they're full of paint. So I'm going to take and try to clean the paint out and then put this in there, see how it lines up. Okay, we're getting some real precision work. I've got a file, three-sided. See what it does.
All right, let me figure this out, and we'll be back. Okay, so here's what I figured you have to do. I got a round file. And you just... So, two more and then we'll squeeze them. You're, where are you going? I'm running the mile. Okay, goodbye. What? Goodbye. goodbye. So, we're having a spring shower, so have to let it uh, quit raining before we get back out on it. Alright, so we got it on, got it all cleaned up. It's fitting pretty good. So now I'm going to take it, instead of using sticky tape, I'm going to uh, drill it, screw it to the back of the tailgate. Looks better than it did. I got an idea for this. But anyway, that's putting on a tailgate cap after you've mangled your bed. That's what you sometimes you gotta do is compromise, just customize, alternifies, whatever other advice, but there it is. Thanks for watching. Right. It's on there.
it's aftermarket and you know when you bend up the tailgate you know they're not always going to be perfect but I like that a lot better than the big old nasty thing that I took off it looking at that thing right there that big old gaping wound <laughs> so there it is 2008 Chevy Silverado LTZ got the Duramax pull 32 foot fifth wheel with it it's been a great truck but there it is